run, run, Bambolina! Faster, faster! Ah, I'm gonna get you, little ones. Ah! No! <laughs> help! Somebody help us! <laughs> hey, buddy. What's going on? Help me, Flynn. Fiddles took Bambolina away. <sighs> I'm sorry, Bam Bam. It's my fault. What? Yes, I made fiddles like that. How the hell could you let this happen? Hey, take it easy, man. Let me explain. Bam Bam, I got something for you. Ta-da! Wow, these hats are gorgeous, Bambolina. I love them. Hey, guys, how's my new look? Wow, trendsetter in the house. Yeah, you're like a walking party. <laughs> Who cares about birthday hats anyways, huh? Huh? This is ridiculous. Screw this, stupid hat. Oh, I can't I wear a hat like everyone else. You're Captain Fiddle, right? But this captain can't lead the team well, you know? Because he has no cap. <laughs> you little brat. Wait, wait, relax, man. I can change your head shape. What do you think? <sighs> head shape? Yeah, we can change it so you can wear whatever stupid hat you want. Hmm, interesting. Okay, you have yourself a deal. Deal? Oh, this looks legit. It's called the transducer. The most advanced invention in the history of garden. Okay, now go inside. Kinda cool, but is it safe? Ah, uh, kinda. Just trust me, I've done it a hundred times before. Wait, that fly, wait! Let's see, bala, deli, bomba, and go! And that's the story of how the great fly man came to be. Are you kidding me? We have to find Bambolina, fast. All right, all right. I wish he had left some traces behind. Look, this must be Fiddle's drool. He must have been here. Ugh, it stinks. Let's hope he doesn't need her. He won't eat her. Bambolina isn't garbage. Wakey, wakey. Ah! Ah, uh, wah. Am I handsome? Please, please, let me out. Not so fast, sunshine. Tell me, does my head look good? Ah, uh, yeah. You look so fine. <laughs> She is! <gasps> Bam Bam! Bambolina! We're here to rescue you! Shh! He's sleeping! I can't move! He's got me handcuffed! The key! Think, think, think! Aha! Okay, Bam Bam, here's the plan. <laughs> Bambolina, are you done yet? Yep, just finished. Whoa. All right, stay put. Easy. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. Here you go. How dare you? Bam Bam, give me this! 
Huh? Don't ask. Just trust me. Did he bother me? Boom! Is that all you've got? Yeah, this is all I got. Take this! Ah! Whew. Wait, if he can do that, why the heck didn't you just shoot him in the first place? Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. Plus, where's the fun in that? Good morning, Sleeping Beauty. Did you enjoy your nap? Ha ha, very funny. Flynn, still don't know why I trusted a stupid octopus. Aw, don't be mad, Fiddles. You're fine just the way you are. You don't need any hat. I'm pretty, by the way. But how? Shh! Dude, tone it down! This is an abandoned kindergarten. Home to giant birds that eat human flesh. But how did you even end up here? Oh, well... My friend Jumbo and I were on a bird hunt. And we caught sight of a strange pink bird. So, when it ran into this place, we followed right after. It looked dark inside, and suddenly there was a hole or something, and we fell down there. And then I woke up and I was here, dressed like this. Hmm, to be fair, you do look gorgeous. No, it's weird. Why did you do this to me? Come on, it's for yours. Quick, hide! Who are you talking to? Girl, no one! You scared me! Hmm, I thought I heard something. Anyway, I just caught an intruder, a big green gorilla. Lord, it's disgusting. But I want to save that fuzzy creature for dinner. <laughs> great! Gorillas make great dishes! Just here to let you know. Make sure you save room for dinner, okay? Okay! Bye, girl! God, that green gorilla is Jumbo! I know! Wait, what is that pinkish scary bird? Is that the flesh-eating one that you were talking about? Yeah, that's Opula. She's kind of the boss here. Back then, this place belonged to me and my two scientist friends. The three of us created this bird from a woman's brain cells. But what we didn't know was that the woman used to be abused by her husband. That's brutal. Yes. That's the origin of Opila's aggressive nature. The worst part is that she ate my two friends right after being released. Ah! Lord, but how did you survive? Stupid, she only eats men. That's why I dressed you up like a woman. Oh. <gasps> oh, that. <sighs> how do you know if a man is stupid? How? His lips move. Oh, you're so mean! That's Opula's favorite joke. I gotta admit, she just gets men. But my friend Jumbo, how am I gonna save him? It'll be tough. But don't worry, I'll help you. First, I need to find some anesthetic. How about me? You need any help? Well, maybe put on some more lipstick. Gather some more girl power, you know? Girls, I've got refreshments. 
Jumbo! <laughs> bad, bad. Where were you? <laughs> Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> Thank you. You look pretty, by the way. Oh, shut up. Okay, boys. Save the hugging, crying stuff for later. Get your butts moving. Opila! All right, guys. Listen. Run to the end of the hall and turn left. You'll see a door. Then use this yellow card to get in. But wait, how do we get past her? I'll take care of that. Now, one, two, three. Hiya! Run! Why did you betray me? Because you are my biggest mistake, Opila! And now it's my responsibility to fix it! And you believe in them? Those two gorillas? More than you, of course! Why are men like commercials? Why? Because you can't trust a word they say. My slingshot! Opila! I can't believe we made it out! Yeah, lesson learned. Don't ever mess with girls. You don't know how angry she can get. Oh, that means I shouldn't mess with you, right? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a sec, guys. One last thing. <laughs> <laughs>